Long time no see. I need your help. I'd say so. Hey, Kurt, I got a question. David, how's the promotion? It's good, I just gotta, um... Hey, good. I just wanted to make sure that the workload isn't too much. I can always send you a temp to help out with the paperwork. Maybe, uh, Kurt, I just sent out an email. Um, my account is compromised? Oh, sorry to hear that. It's happened to me before, too. Really? Yeah, I guess it comes with the job in some ways. Why do you care? You got something to hide? Uh, no, nah, of course not. Then don't worry about it. The data breach affected millions of accounts. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't call the police right now and turn you in. You're the only one that'll believe me. You know I didn't do this. You know I can't get involved in this. I'm on probation because of you, remember? What do you want me to do, apologize? It was five years ago. I did what I had to do. I was doing my job. And I was doing the right thing. There are things going on at that firm behind closed doors. I'm not here for your conspiracy theory. This is not a conspiracy. I just need you to help me clear my name. I don't owe you anything. But maybe there is something you can help me with. This morning? I clicked on something. Uh, I think I installed a malware on my computer or something. You work for a data collection agency and you fell for a malware attack? I'm an accountant. What are you so afraid of anyway? Look, I'm not trying to be in another investigation, that's all. A data breach? Don't flatter yourself. I wouldn't worry about it. We have state-of-the-art security and it would prevent any intrusion. Kirk keeps calling me. Uh, make sure you change your password. Though. Why would I do that? Well, our company system is designed to protect company information, not your personal data, so your account may have been compromised. But doesn't the software protect against this? The company, not you. Try it again. It's not letting me, man. Why would they revoke your privileges? There's only a few instances where they can do that without speaking to you first. Uh, unless... Have you been taking bribes? I didn't do anything. Damn! Stop right there! Something happened at work today. Can you meet me at the house? David, what's going on? Look, I'll be there shortly. I'm at home. The police are here. Look, it, it, it's not what it... I didn't do this. They said you ran from the police. Is that true? Look, I'll, I'll figure it out, okay? What? David, just, just turn yourself in. When I leaked the data five years ago, I thought I was able to expose the corruption that was going on in the firm. The bribes, the fraud, everything. But I've been running the numbers since I've gotten out of prison and it just doesn't add up. Whoever is behind this corruption has been able to hide their identity really well. No, no, no. The company went through a complete corporate audit supervised by the FTC. If it was a fraud, it would have been caught. You think a company whose sole purpose is to sell and store data isn't capable of fooling a government agency? 
you know someone is framing you, and I'm telling you, it's someone in that company. Looks like he searched someone's address. Robin Loxley. Is that the ex-con guy who, uh... Yeah, the whistleblower. This is not the company that you signed on to work for. Help me get the information on who's behind this. I can't do that. If this ever gets out that I broke my confidentiality agreement, my career is over. Your career is over. We don't have much time. Don't click that.